Piaggio Vespa 400. The Vespa 400 is a rear-engined microcar, produced by ACMA in Fort France, from 1957 to 1961 to the designs of the Italian Piaggio company. Three different versions were sold, the Lux, Tourism and GT. The car made its high-profile public debut on September 26, 1957 at a press presentation staged in Monaco. The ACMA directors ensured a good attendance from members of the press by also inviting three celebrity racing drivers to the Vespa 400 launch. The 400 was a two-seater with room behind the seats to accommodate luggage or two small children on an optional cushion. The front seats were simple tubular metal frames with cloth upholstery on elastic springs and between the seats were the handbrake, starter and choke. The gear change was centrally floor-mounted. The rear hinge doors were coated on the inside with only a thin plastic lining attached to the metal door panel skin allowing valuable extra internal space. On the early cars the main door windows did not open which attracted criticism, but increased the usable width for the driver and passenger. Instrumentation was very basic with only a speedometer and warning lights for low fuel, main beam, dynamo charging and indicators. The cabriolet fabric roof could be rolled back from the windscreen header rail to the top of the rear engine cover leaving conventional metal sides above the doors. The 12-volt battery was located at the front of the car, behind the dummy front grille, on a shelf that could be slid out. The spare wheel was stowed in a well under the passenger seat. The high-profile launch paid off, with 12,130 cars produced in 1958. That turned out to be the high point, however, and output fell to 8,717 in 1959 despite a price reduction for the entry-level two-seater normal coup from 345,000 francs to 319,500 francs between October 1957 and October 1958. Commentators suggested that the chic image created at the time of the launch was not always matched by the car itself, with its awkward gear change, poor soundproofing and, especially before a modification to the carburetor specification, high fuel consumption. The car's origins, developed by a leading world producer of motor scooters, Italy's Piaggio company, makers of the Vespa since 1946, was reflected in the installation, in the Vespa 400 of a two-stroke, motorbike-style, engine which required oil to be added to the petrol, gasoline whenever the car was refueled. During the summer of 1958 the cars were fitted with a semi-automatic device for adding oil to the fuel, but a fully automatic fuel mixing device was not included until two years later. The British Motor Magazine tested a 400 Deluxe Saloon in 1959 recording a top speed of 51.8 miles per hour. 83.4 km per hour, and acceleration from 0 to 40 miles per hour, 64 km per hour, in 23.0 seconds and a fuel consumption of 55.3 miles per imperial gallon, 5.11 liters slash 100 km, 46.0 miles per gallon US. The test car cost 351,725 old French francs cheaper than the 374,000 old French francs domestic market starting price quoted towards the end of 1958 for the cheapest version of the larger but, even, less powerful Citroen 2CV, 